So today we're going to talk about an article that makes me upset. And that's the unwritten rules of hiring someone. And then having to get through that just to make an unreasonable amount of money, which you can probably never get $30 million. So everyone that's making 100000 you're not going to get, you have to make $30 million in order to, to, in today's money, just to, you know, uh, retire. Anyway. Boss uses coffee cup tests in every interview and won't hire anyone who fails. All right. I mean, look, I mean you already have it bad enough. There, there's so many little things, but you're going to not hire someone because they didn't go clean their cup of coffee cup? They didn't clean their cup of they didn't clean their coffee cup. Like these little hidden things, you know. Like I remember at the job that I was uh, working at, uh, the waiters would have to walk with their uh, tray or whatever, right? So that they could hold it up. And then on top of that, the hidden thing was, if they didn't look good, they couldn't get hired. What the hell? What's, what's these little hidden things, you know? You know? And I don't like that. I mean, I don't even want to read this whole story. I've already read like, half of it, and I'm just like, this is fucking stupid. Why, why, why do you already have this stuff? It's not even decided on my merits of what I've accomplished. There was no point of even going to college or getting that piece of paper if it's meaningless. If the boss says, oh, well, I got my own standards, you know? So, yeah, that, that pisses me off, you know? I mean, I'm already complaining about gatekeeping. Like, I'm, you know, like, I have you know, misdemeanors and shit, you know, and, you know, what's the misdemeanor do, the insurance people say, well, we can't hire, you can't hire those people, because we won't cover you, what kind of stupid shit is that, so I'm already blacklisted from cleaning, because I can't get a job in it, because of insurance companies, not because the companies that or cleaning, no, they said so they'd hire me, but because the insurance, I can't hire, I can't be hired, all right, yeah, oh, this is another thing, like, oh, I went to, like, this guy, he went to the office, he talked to a receptionist, and didn't look the receptionist in his, uh, in her eyes, or his, or her, or whoever, in the eye, so he failed to get a job there. Because he didn't look the receptionist in their eyes. What the f***? What kind of worker do you want, alright? You're not getting a 50s worker, alright? A 1950s worker, alright? You want, actually, yeah, that's right. You want a 1950s worker with... You know, like nineteen twenty pay. You know, it just don't make any sense. Why do you you got these special stipulations? No one said to go by. You just like, well, I just feel like that's the way it should be. It's gonna be that way. You know, it's, it's just crazy uh, how these people can make up these hidden rules and shit. You know, like, you know, like I can't even start my own cleaning business. And that's something. I can't go and clean someone's house or, or clean a business or something because the insurance wouldn't cover me. So that that's that's my pet peeve, you know. Oh, man, does it... It bothers the crap out of me so much, man. Man, I just want to be like... You know. But, yeah. That's what's bothering me today, this damn article. I mean, you you know, like I, I you know, I, I, you know, I hate gatekeepers. But I don't like management at all. I don't like management. Mm -mm. Nope. Because <laughs> of this stuff, you know, it's like, what are you, what, what's the secret hiring thing? <laughs> anyway, I'm not going through this. I already read it. I'm already upset, as you can tell. You know, you're like, 
You know. He claims this trick works like a charm.